Y'all get ready. Yes, you get ready. This news in the streets. Join us and tune in for the tea. Breaking news with integrity. So sell your friends and your family. It's the lovely TV show. Bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the lovely TV show. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe. Hey, tea sippers. It's officially TGIF. This week has went by super duper fast, honey. So if you guys do not know, this morning, P. Diddy. And not that P. Diddy, P-I-D-D-Y, but P-E-E-D-I-D-D-Y, P. Diddy, okay? What's trending? What's trending all over Twitter this morning? It is a hot damn mess. People logged on to Twitter to see who the hell this new P-E-E Diddy was, only to find out that the reason why this was trending was because of Carisha. You know, City Girls Carisha. She recently did an interview with Trina where she admitted that she loved golden showers. What the hell? Child, y'all go ahead and watch this clip real quick. I can't say it. You got to. It say take a shot if you like golden showers. I do. Golden showers? Meaning when the guy pees on you? Mm-hmm. Pee on you everywhere? You like it? I just like it. You do? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Freak of the week, huh? So you say take a shot. You not take. You say take a shot. Oh, we need yeah, a shot. I take a shot. I you like go to shower. I do. But it's like just, peeing on you. I don't know. It's just I don't know. Mm. It's just do something. I'm gonna be too. honest. Hold on, one more thing. I need something a little, a little less. Right? So I'm gonna be honest with you. I've never had a golden shower. I did. did you? <laughs> <laughs> I've never had a golden shower. Like I've given one. Oh, is that Ooh. the same thing as squirting or? Yeah, they well they say that I don't know, but I I don't had a golden shower and I like. I it. give them, I give them, mm-hmm. golden shower, huh? <laughs> <laughs> but I've never, I've never experienced that. Hmm. It's, I'm all about trying new things though. <laughs> Golden shower. It's, it's fun. Yeah, like, you know when you drunk and you just and they just ping all over. All right, y'all just watch that clip. It got so bad that they literally had R. Kelly trending. Okay. As we all remember, R. Kelly and his infamous pissy video, uh, Dave Chappelle was trending because Dave Chappelle spoofed R. Kelly's pissy video. So this entire situation is a mess. So the internet is definitely going back and forth about this. And to me, the city girls are down a thousand points, okay? Um, I don't care, again, what grown adults do in the bedroom, but I don't understand why every podcast now has to just be about overt sexuality, what people are doing in the bedroom, how they like it, who they're smashing. It's almost like a lot of podcasts, especially ones that are hip hop related, a lot of them talk about nothing besides sex. Everything is always sex based just overtly sexual, just low gutter conversations. You know, I get it. It's entertainment. You know, it's food for fodder. But it's almost like, why? who asked for this? Like, why do we need to know this? And my thing is this. It's, it's not a flex. Somebody relieving themselves on you is not a flex. And her saying that it turns her on and she's into it. I'm getting porta potty vibes. I'm getting I'll do anything to be in certain spaces like a lot of IG models. I'm getting Dubai vibes, okay? OMG, I've seen a lot. Like it doesn't even have to be my booking email. It could just be my DMs. I've gotten offers for like $10,000 and a plane trip to like Dubai to spend a weekend for golden showers. <laughs> Wait, what's golden sh- <laughs> Oh, okay, I get it now. I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Wow, they've actually said that that's exactly what they wanted to do. Yeah, I've had a lot of strange requests for money. Now, okay, do you think that's a real request? Do you think somebody's really willing to pay $10,000 to pee on you? Definitely. Just look at me. (laughs) (laughs) If I was a man and, like, my thing was golden showers, and I seen someone like me, I'm like, OMG, I'd pay her 10000 to pee on her. <laughs> wow. And when you're willing to do anything to be in certain spaces and to be around certain people, you'll let them do whatever. You know, so she's making it seem like this is such a turn on. 
Um, I don't know. Me personally, I just find it gross. But like I said, to each his own. Maybe I'm old fashioned, but you're not peeing on me. OK, because if, if you start peeing on me, then the next thing would be that damn uh, Biggie Small skit where the damn girl had Biggie shitting on her. Absolutely the fuck not. We got to know when to say when. If you give a fool an inch, they're going to take a mile. If I let you pee on me, then the next conversation is, well, you might as well let me boo-boo on you, too. Absolutely the hell not. Wow, well, no, so boy, I thought shit's on the bitch, right? <laughs> <laughs> And I would not be surprised if she was also getting that done. We all know Diddy's a fucking freak, um, as many are in the industry. But I, it's just, to me, it's a bit much. I just feel like she puts all her business in the streets and she thinks this is cute. And then as soon as people don't agree with it or call her out or say that she's disgusting, then it's, I don't care, that's my business. Well, if you didn't care, you wouldn't keep taking to Twitter to tell folks that you don't care. So obviously you care. You know, again, what grown folks choose to do is they're grown as business. But at some point in time, there's a such thing called couth. And this is a mother of two. She has a little girl and she has a little boy. And I think her son is about probably eight or nine. Um, he's going to be old enough eventually to Google this stuff, to look up his mother. And I don't think any young boy wants to hear about his mother being pissed on. You know, and even her daughter, like, what are you showing her? You know, being involved in this weird haram with Diddy. And now you're bragging about getting pissed on. You know, and, and yeah, granted, it could have not been Diddy peeing on her, but I think it was. It could have been, you know, her other baby daddy or, you know, boyfriends in the past. But I don't know, peeing on people, that, that sounds like some rich people shit. Well, I don't know, it just sounds like some rich people shit. It just sounds like... Some Dubai shit. I can just see her in the middle of all these men in Dubai, and they're just all pissing on her, pissing on her forehead, pissing in her mouth. You know, it just looks like people just take a piss fest on her, especially being that she says she's so turned on by it. Girl, bye. Anyways, y'all, I'm over these celebrities and they're oversharing. It's starting to be a bit much. I'm going to need Carisha, a.k.a. Urethra Brownlee, to go sit the hell down and quit spilling all types of unnecessary tea that we didn't ask for, okay? So anyways, y'all, y'all go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire pissy situation, honey, concerning Carisha telling Trina that she loves to have golden showers showered upon her body. Let me know your thoughts. How do y'all feel about this? And do you feel like a lot of celebrities are doing far too much oversharing nowadays? Don't forget to hit the like button. Feel free to share the video. And most importantly, make sure you still subscribe to the channel. And I'll talk to y'all later. Deuces. If you want the latest news in the streets, join us sentiment for the tea. Breaking news with integrity. So sir, your friends and your family. It's the lovely TV show. Bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the lovely TV show. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe.